Welcome to another Arkansas Wild Man Survival. The plant I've been uh, waiting on has finally bloomed. This is a button snake root or rattlesnake master. And uh, you can tell the difference by the toothed edges on the leaves, which rese resemble a snake's mane, which this was used to treat snake bite by the American Indians. And uh, they would chew the root before handling the snakes in ceremonies. But uh, American Indians used root as a poultice for snake bite, toothaches, bladder trouble for coughs. Nigeria, also an endemic, a traditional root tincture was used as a diuretic. Also for female reproduction disorders, gleat, gonorrhea, piles, and rheumatism. Chewing the root increases the slava flow. Do not confuse it with a, the false aloe or false rattlesnake master, which I'd showed uh, in a previous video. Uh, this one, you can tell by the spines. But the settlers would, they claimed that if they, they chewed a root and rubbed it on their hands, they could handle snakes without getting bit. Now that's just what they claimed. I don't know if there's anything to it or not. This herb is still bought today by the pharmaceutical company uh, as a button snake root. But uh, that is rattlesnake master or button snake root. And that is today's medical plant. God bless you, and as always, thanks for watching. Arkansas Wall Man Survival.